Okay, so that lovely song that you just heard was all about prefixes and suffixes. We're going to continue to look at prefixes today and then we'll move on to suffixes tomorrow. So I've got a little challenge for you to start off the day. Um, I have got some root words and what I'd like you to do is add a prefix to these words to change their meaning. So the root words I've got are behave, sense, kind, polite, right, honest and made. And those prefixes on the right hand side Re, un, pre, dis, im, non, miss. One of those fits in each one of the root words to make a new word and to change its meaning. So I will give you 30 seconds to see if you can put the correct prefix with the root word. Your time starts now. Ten seconds left. Okay, let's see if you were right. So the first one, behave, the prefix you should have chosen would be miss to make the word misbehave. Sense, the prefix you should have chosen would be non, so you have nonsense. Kind, the prefix would be un. So you'd have unkind. Polite, the word that you can make with the prefix im is impolite. Someone who's not very polite is impolite. For right, you could have used the prefix re to rewrite something. For honest, you could use the prefix dis to make the word dishonest. And for made, you could have used the prefix pre, pre-made. So I hope you got all of those right. You are going to be having a go at deciding what prefixes you could put in front of some words today. And there are quite a lot of them. I think there are about 40 for you to have a go at. And for some of them, there might be more than one option for a prefix to use. So if you think there's more than one option, put both in and see how many words you can make. Now, I just want to leave you with one final question, which will help to set you up for your work tomorrow. And that is, how is a suffix different to a prefix? So if you have a think about that today, and that will help you when we start our suffix work tomorrow. Good luck.